Center said that it is ready to discuss the Manipur issue in the upcoming monsoon session of the parliament. The decision was announced during an all-party meeting called by the Bharatiya Janata Party-led central government to discuss various matters for the monsoon session. Lok Sabha Speaker Om Birla chaired the meeting, which aimed to deliberate on a range of issues related to the session. The monsoon session of the parliament will begin from July 20th and will continue till August 11th. Prime Minister Narendra Modi said technology helped the ND government in cropping 10 crore FAG beneficiaries in the country who were never born. Using the three powers of Jan, Dan, Adar and Mobile, we stopped crores of FAG beneficiaries from snatching rights of poor, Prime Minister Modi said. 30 lakh crore given directly to beneficiaries via DPT in nine years, he added. After Assam Chief Minister Himanta Biswa Sarma on Tuesday took a jibe at the formation of a coalition of the opposition parties, NAM Indian National Developmental Inclusive Alliance, the Congress responded today calling it a surplus of sour grabs in its mouth. Sarma said on Tuesday that we should strive to free ourselves from colonial legacies after the British named the country India. The Supreme Court has granted regular bail to activist Testa Satalvat in a case of alleged evidence fabrication in connection to the 2002 Gujarat riots. The Apex Court ordered that Satalvat shall not make any attempt to influence witnesses in the case and will keep away from them. It quashed Gujarat's High Court's order asking her to surrender. In the Karnataka Assembly, Speaker U.T. Khader took disciplinary action against 10 BJP MLS after they engaged in disruptive behavior by throwing papers at the chair. The incident occurred during the proceedings when the MLS threw papers at Deputy Speaker Rudrapa Lamani in the afternoon. Russian lawmaker Andrei Kartopolov said that the Wagner's group expulsion to Belarus puts Russia in a position to strike North Atlantic Treaty Organization targets near Poland and Lithuania. A strike force by Wagner is ready to take this corridor in a matter of hours, Kartopolov said. His remarks came after Poland moved troops early this month to its eastern border due to Wagner concerns. <music> Delhi police in its charge sheet against Wrestling Federation of India Chief Breach Bhushan Sharan Singh have claimed that be it India or abroad, the powerful politicians sexually harass women wrestlers on multiple occasions. The 1,599-page charge sheet highlights a specific incident of inappropriate sexual contact. 